I come from in East London. Whenever they went on tour, the Queen of the ICF followed. This led to an all-out riot at a gig in Birmingham. The ICF were behind us. We must have been about 22, 23 handed. Mm. So there's 500 in this gig, it's packed. But not all the 500 on the rear. There's got to be 200. 200 so we're at the front and um, they keep on. I remember there was a geezer with a filler tattoo, like that skinhead, and he kept going, fucking wanker, wanker. We thought so, it was a very unusual yeah. villa, villa yeah. and Burnham, Burnham City to yeah. be under one roof United in the first place. So they kept yeah. on, we'd stop up a couple of gigs. Then someone, I think they threw a pint glass or something. Wrong move, because I said, whoever threw that, I said, we'll stop the gig now. I said, I'll take you outside one-on-one, -on -one, blah, blah, blah. You know, it's never going to happen, but that's what you say at the time. So now all of a sudden, we played on again, and things were really getting bad. Then we ended one song. We went to start the next one. I couldn't hear the guitar. What was the guitar? And I turned around, Mick, Mick, where are you? I turned around. Mick's in the audience. I like, just going, smash, crash, bosh. She's going right up. So that was it, like, we was down in amongst them. We drove them back, but we drove them back to the bar, which was, like, for them... And all of a sudden they've got the glasses, the ashtrays. I started talking up. Nick was standing next to me and I always remember it. It was like like a UFO, flying saucer, like this big glass ashtray. One of these buggers. No. Come hurtling the walls like that. It was me and Meg. I thought, who's it going to do? All of a sudden it hit me right there like, bosh, like Claret and Blue Army, straight out. Well, that was like Red Rag or a bolt. It was the worst example.